Welcome back everybody. Today is, I have another guest on my channel. This is my mom. Say hi. Hi. Um, she lives up in Michigan and was visiting me for the weekend and I thought I'd bring her on the channel today because we're talking about, zip it up, a dot bag. And this is from the company OLPR. Um, and they reached out to me and said, hey, we found your YouTube channel and we would like you to review this bag. Are you interested? I've never owned a dot bag. So I'm kind of zooming you in on it right now. It's also called a... <laughs> My mom has a different name for it. It's not a dot bag. What's it called, mom? A ditty bag. A ditty bag. Has anyone ever heard it called a ditty bag? Do you, you want to tell me why? From when the military would use it to keep their toiletries in. Sailors. Yes. But also your father and my, the army. My dad was in the army and he had a ditty bag. So we also looked up what dot bag means. Do you remember? Um, the manufacturer. His name? last name was like Dopplet, Dop, Doppel. Yep. And he was a leather maker from Germany and he made this in the turn of the century and called it a dot bag. Anyway, so if you didn't know. Um, and why are you on my channel today? Because we are taking my traveling cosmetic bag and putting it into the dot ditty bag. <laughs> the dot ditty bag, y'all. <laughs> um, okay, so when I opened this the other day, it came in the mail while my mom was visiting. She was like, oh, that's exactly what I want. And I, her birthday was recently, and I had given her this makeup bag. This is from Target. I have the identical one, and I use it. And she saw this and was like, I think I want that one over this one. So the question is, should I give my mother this Dop Diddy bag? Uh, but what we're going to do today is she's going to unload her makeup and put it in here and see how it all fits. Should we do that now? Yeah, let's jump in. Okay. This is this is a little bit more compartmentalized. Oh, I want to say one more thing before you keep going. Um, near the end of this video, I'm going to show my uh, what my watercolor supplies look like fitting in here, what my makeup bag looks like in here because I have more eyeshadow palettes, and I'm also going to do one with my husband's... Um, Toiletries? Toiletries. Just so, and that's going to be kind of like a headshot overview where you can see everything fitting in. But this is like the fun interview part. Okay. All right. So, are so you let's ready? hold up what you have, if you I don't have mind. just a lot of um, makeup and toiletries and some medicine and uh, yeah. makeup brushes and just general stuff. And two so. pouches. So, so how often do you travel? About once every two months. Or so. yeah, okay. And she has a lake house, so yeah. You're so we up go there. up on the weekends. I just grab a bag and go. All right, I'm holding it so you guys can see it in frame. Okay, so we're gonna start putting things in, like face cream, toothbrush, little compact with medicines in it, I um, contact information, blush, contact holders. Um, what is this stuff? Takes all my brown dots off my face. Some more cream. <laughs> Concealer. Concealer. <laughs> deodorant, some medical cream, and then show what you're doing. There is a se uh, separate area that I, but since I just got this bag, um, I'm not used to compartmentaling. My other one was quite large and with no compartments, more makeup. Oh, she had this huge pouch from West Elm that was falling apart. So this yep. is, this is what she's going into. A little hair, toothpaste. <laughs> Right, <laughs> some hair, <laughs> right. Um, and then I shadow. Okay, now and I'm not done. This is what's great. So then, so far we're at this point. I mean, so much can fit. Have, you know, dental floss and two uh, other things in here, and I, this is a little um, bag for my jewelry. So it all goes in nicely. Wow, I still feel like you have some room. Right, I know. So and this was it? bulging. I'll zip it. And now it goes. I'm in. showing you it's zipping. Super easy. So people who don't mind everything in one um, uncompartmentalized pouch. To be close. Okay. And what do you think about this? A handle. Yeah. I really, I really like it. I really think it's, uh, <sighs> Guys, it's I not so feminine looking as some makeup bags, but I think that it's still very sturdy. Because dot bag is generally a man's world. Right. 
but that does not Did bother me. Yeah. Did he bang? <laughs> I have to call the video dot bag Yes, kid, you're right. That's what right, this right, company right. calls it. But maybe in the description we'll say the Debbie Diddy bag. <laughs> That's her name, Debbie. Okay, so this one does come with a handle. This is in natural horine uh, leather. And um, not every bag on their website has a handle. So note that. But they're saying it's helpful to hang on the back door of um, the bathroom, hotel, if you don't have a lot of counter space. What? The stitching is very nice. <laughs> you want me to show stitching them the stitching? is very straight. So... And uh, very nice. Let me talk about this company really quick. Um, this company, who reached out to me, they are a family from Ukraine, and they are living in North Carolina, and they're selling leather goods because the shipment time from Ukraine to here was like a month. So they were not liking um, how they couldn't help customer service that way. But we're zooming you in to show you the stitching because on their website, they are very descriptive about how particular they are with stitching and leather quality and how long it's going to last. Did I tell you it retails for 65? Mm -hmm. And this is eight inches by four inches by four inches. I didn't point this out, but there's a tab right here that you can hold while you're zipping. And then oh, unzip. Nice. And look, okay. if there's a tab on this side very that you nice. can hold. <laughs> you're just saying very nice, very it is. nice. It is. Um, I, I'm pretty sure this is going to be yours, but I... Not this trip. I'm, maybe No, I'm struggling trip. because I want to see if it works for me, but maybe I'll have to go buy another. I can another. go back with this, and then we can redo it another time. How many children do you have? Six. What? You're number four. I'm number four. I mean, she's done already so much by just giving birth to all of us, but... I'm glad she got to visit me and hang out in St. Louis. So we'll we'll keep discussing right. in the comments. Let me know what do you think. Should, right, should I yeah, give this to my mother? Right, they'll decide or go ahead with you know, which is very nice. And this one's fine. It was right. just you know six dollars. It's um, wipeable. Oh, we didn't really discuss. What do you think about things being liquid in here? Well, um, like you suggested, putting things in a uh, plastic bag in case they drip because like it shampoo. is leather. It interior, so it's not lined. Unlined. So that would make a difference. All right. Top ditty bag. You're going to leave? Yep. Um, so guys, we're going to just stay right here. We're going to redo the camera, and I will add more footage on what more can fit in here. But this is a great option. It feels great. My mom's happy. We'll talk to you later. Say bye. Goodbye.